So who's happy it's Friday, huh? This guy. Yeah. Okay, so I've got a lot to talk about today. Not a lot of time. Actually, I don't actually have that much to talk about. I got a couple things, but whatever. First, I really hope that your friend is okay. I mean, losing your house and your stuff. I mean, I get it. It's just stuff and we shouldn't, you know, worry about stuff. And But I mean, there's stuff and then there's stuff. You know, there's the, oh, I lost my, you know, stove and I lost my photos and my family mementos that I can never get back. And I mean, that's the... That's the tragedy. And hopefully everyone got out okay. So, yeah. So, I'm really, you know, it's good that, that you're stepping up and helping out your friends. So, I mean, that's really admirable. And, um, yeah. Wow, that came across way less sincere than I actually meant it to. You know, it's a good stuff. You're doing good. Keep up the good work. And, God, I'm horrible at this. Changing subjects. Yes, Lucy is fine. She had to go to Children's Hospital yesterday. Her surgery really wasn't as big a deal that I made it sound, and I'm sorry. Uh, she had to get her back molar removed, and she's had horrible, horrible, horrible experience so far in her short little life with the dentist, and hates it. And so every time we go to get anything done, she's had five or six fillings that you do. Literally four people have to hold her down. And seeing as we, uh... She's told us that she has nightmares about people breaking into the house to steal her teeth. We didn't really think that taking her to the dentist, which she hates to have them literally steal her tooth, would be a good thing. So we had to go the general anesthesia route, knock her out, and it was just a big drama day. Just long, drawn out, poor kid got through it. But, tooth fairy came, and that's always good. She'd like that bit. Finally, I've been doing some growing up today, yesterday, day before, whatever, I don't know. And uh, I feel like I owe you guys, Lauren, a bit of an apology because I've been a really whiny little person on Twitter. I'm always like, yeah, I want a restaurant. Yeah, I want this, I want that. No. You know what? It's time to grow the F up, James. And I'm really trying to do that. So, um, I'm going to really stop just being silly I guess you know I'm 30 I need to get real uh, there's things I'm not gonna be able to do owning a restaurant is probably one of them <laughs> Lauren I look forward to hopefully seeing you in lime green on Monday and so enjoy your weekend but of course curse you and I'll see you Monday see ya